So basically, my car does this now. Never plan to modify your N54 or BMW uh, without doing maintenance. One of the most crucial parts of becoming stage two um, on these cars and pretty much all other BMWs, grading your coil packs. So here we've got Delphi coil packs. Um, demand quite a premium. Uh, I managed to pick them up off a guy off uh, Facebook um, who used them on his car for about like a thousand miles roughly around there and then he upgraded. Because I actually already have one. Um, in there when Martin from PMP Cars uh, fixed my wastegates and everything he put one in there in cylinder one so yeah we're running on five Bosch and one Delphi these so this is the Delphi one these ones so up from I'd say cylinder one all the way up until cylinder four is perfectly fine to do um, the coil packs you don't need to remove anything and um, to get to the last two you do have to remove this section uh, this section uh, this section as well which is absolute ball ache um, I don't know I might spare you guys the whole thing of that and just show you me doing these because I can do it real quick oh unclip it here that's unclipped oh god that's in oh, I think it's melted on there oh. all right Jesus that's how much I haven't been to the gym. Ow. Oh, yeah, that was on. Ooh. New one on. Delphi. Nice. In. That's in. In. That's number one. This one up. Oh, yeah, come on, man. That was a lot easier. This one in, like that. Like. Ah. Ah. Right, this one I might have to, gonna have to mount the camera up. Right, every bolt in this car is pretty much 145K so 145,000 miles done. So yeah, <laughs> it's uh, virtually on the last legs. And since this isn't even like on the thing, it's uh, unless you just on hand, yeah, hand loosen that, loose that one off. It's take off. Um, I'd advise probably um, more than likely you can take that sensor off here, but we don't know. Yeah, we're not proper mechanics here, we're doing a bodge way. <laughs> like this one, and then the back two. That seems like the best course of action, probably. Let me cut to when we get those done. Last one. Have a look, have a look cool. What we got, what we got here. Woo, Ooh, you're lying, no way. Have a guess what this is guys. I'm not gonna let you know, but yeah. Yeah, we got some, some, some sauce incoming, incoming, so. I'm so excited. Oh man, it's like, I feel like it just makes me fall back in love with this car, guys. If you ever feel like you're falling out of love with your car, just do something to it. And when you do something to it after, yeah, it changes your whole perspective again. So, I uh, wake up at some mad time. I'm already, I'm still late regardless, but yeah. Uh, and I need to get some fuel because 
It's mother. It's drinks, man. It drinks. I, I wanted to argue against it. I didn't, but I put like 45 pound in. Actually, I've done a lot of driving. To be fair, like a lot of driving, but um, I put 45 pound in the other day, and it took me to almost a full tank after like two days of driving. Look where I am, fam. Jesus. And also, these cars, they hate. If you got a standard fuel pump, they hate being under a quarter. So, cause they're, um, I believe they're bucketed from stock, but or they're, they're bucketless. I can't remember how it works. I think they're bucketless, um, which means that the fuel pump isn't contained. Anyway, that's a that's a that's for another story. That's for another. I don't need to bore you guys with that. Yeah, we're going to we fix today to fit the downpipe. So, let's get to it. It's the plug, the real plug. This guy here, fam. <laughs> the real plug. I roll you in the sit. But. Cash. I need to get a cash point yeah. as well to get for joining Yeah, we've got the down pipes. Oh, oil leaks everywhere. Oh, it's okay. Well, fine. Look at that bolt. You can't close that bolt. Yeah, nah, I heard it was going to be close. But the problem is, if you get engine like yeah. chill, yeah. it's going to hit these things. Yeah. I think some people actually. um. They bash that a bit, a little bit. Yeah, I yeah. mean, cut that off, cut that off, yeah. cut that off, but you don't really want to be doing that. Nah, nah, of course. That hits you back in place. Yeah. All under the weeds take off. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds sweet though, not blowing luckily. Nah. It's alright, it sounds good. It's not, it's not loud like how I thought it was going to be like. Yeah, like in terms of under load, it's nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah wait till turbos. I know, I know. Damn. Sounds all right. Yeah. Sounds all right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so dead. <laughs> I know, mate. Don't worry. I know. I know. <laughs> I should ride with no plate. <laughs> nah, nah, don't mind. Oh, cool, welcome. Welcome to the end of the video, guys. I actually show you guys was uh, I actually flashed MHD Stage 2 Plus. He filmed it once before me flashing Stage 1, so I didn't think I was going to do it again. Um, I literally just did flash and map uh, V9, and then I bought the Stage 2 Plus, and I'm running on 98 Ron. All which is uh, in the US, that's 93 octane. Interesting to get the 102 octane uh, map, get get that going. So when I pick up some, some octane boost the next, I might do some runs in that. Leave you guys with a 160 to one, or an attempt of a 60 to, 60 to speed limit to, uh, time. <laughs> and I'll leave some flames and stuff, because I literally just discovered today that it just flames like crazy. Um, which I'm gonna do a video on itself because that's actually super interesting how I did that. Literally, yeah, just flame galore. I'm gonna do some, you know, you're gonna get like one POV uh, pull and then you, I'll give you guys like some flame action. Literally just continues just flames. Uh, and there's literally like flame like a GTR, it's crazy. So uh, with that guys, enjoy the action.
chick there, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Everywhere that we go, we be popping up. Yeah, we pop.